Well, moving on now, there is a lot that goes into the agriculture industry from deciding what seeds to plant to learning about the latest technology. And there's a program through UNL aimed at helping producers make some of those decisions. So joining us now with more on that is Jay Parsons. He is director for the Center for Agricultural Profitability. So thanks for being here today, Jay. Thanks for having me on. Yeah. Good morning. So tell us more about the Center for Agricultural Profitability. <laughs> well, the center, first of all, it's only three years old. It, it was officially uh, started in the summer of 2021. Of course, a couple of years of uh, planning that went into mm -hmm. getting that going, but it was started within our Department of Agricultural Economics, and I got to give a shout out to our former uh, department head, Larry Van Tassel, it was really his vision, the support of the faculty to get this uh, thing up and running. And the, so the center is an interdisciplinary center um, to support informed decision making in agriculture, and agriculture decisions can be quite complex, and so. So we base what we do off of applied research that comes out of the university and, uh, and then we focus on education and we're used to the university educating on campus, but of course this also entails a, a strong extension component where we're educating producers and helping them sort through the information and just make good choices that lead to, to profits for one thing, but, mm -hmm. but also just a sustainable and, uh, and uh, enjoyable future as, as an ag producer in the state. Mm -hmm. Can you give us maybe an example of what you do at the center? Like what would be an example of what you do? Well, uh, on the research side, a lot of things that uh, say the crop scientists or the animal scientists are working on involve some sort of production technology that they're looking to implement. And so we'll help them analyze some of that in terms of the cost and the, and the returns from that okay. implementation of that technology and help them with the outreach component and communicating some of those finances and some of that give and take on the financial side to producers. On the education side, it just uh, when we go out and do uh, workshops with producers or whatever that just kind of carries over into that working with the different disciplines on that and then of course we got a lot of workshops on our own where we focus specifically say on marketing issues or uh, insurance uh, risk management issues and things like that um, we do a lot with finance of course too as we see interest rates go up and profits ebb and flow with the different market situations mm -hmm. so how do you see the program growing in the future well we're gonna uh, we we do get a lot of grants for education. We're involved in a lot of grants on the on the research side. We want to continue to do that. We also want to strengthen partnerships with agribusiness entities and commodity groups in the state and different uh, producer organizations, and just work together. Be kind of a cohesive unit um, from an interdisciplinary standpoint on campus. That's easy for us to look across at the different. Uh, departments on campus and work collaboratively, collaboratively with mm -hmm. them like we have in the past. But we also want to carry that out into the state and work with all the different entities throughout the state to um, basically produce the best results that we can for our agricultural producers. Mm -hmm. All right, and where would people go uh, to get more information? Well, our website is cap.unl.edu, so CAP for Center for Ag Profitability. Uh, we got a, a lot of material up there. We do weekly webinars, we have podcasts, we have a newsletter that goes out to like 5,500 subscribers. Um, we just kind of coalesce a lot of the stuff there. We also link together with some of the other uh, groups on campus when we, hit, we each put out different uh, um, articles or whatnot, and, and we collaborate with them and make sure it's all linked up on our website so people can find it. All right. Perfect, all right. Well, thanks for coming in. Thanks for having me mm -hmm. on. You bet, all right.